Hello, in this video I will be talking about glow-in-the-dark paint. Glow-in-the-dark paints have different glowing times that are directly related to the quality of the paint, the application methods, and how many coats you paint an item with. The lifespan of a premium glow-in-the-dark paint can be up to 10 years, while the time it glows each night after being exposed to the sun varies greatly from one brand to another. Properly prepared surfaces and thicker paint result in brighter colors that glow for longer periods of time. The actual lifespan of your glow-in-the-dark projects can be up to 10 years. The amount of hours that it will actually glow per night depends on how much sunlight it gets on your outdoor project during the day, the brand, the preparation of the item before painting, and the quality of the paint as well. Three to four hours of sunlight are needed as a general rule for your glow-in-the-dark outside objects to light up at night. It works just like a solar light does. There are two main types of glow-in-the-dark paints, fluorescent and phosphorescent. Both will light up in the dark, but the difference between the two is that fluorescent paints will only glow in the dark when you have a black light on them. Phosphorescent paints charge up with sunlight and make excellent paints for most glow-in-the-dark applications. Some artists use glow-in-the-dark paints for their paintings that will be displayed on a wall or easel with a black light shining on them. This is the most common use for phosphorescent gel paints, and they will also work well for murals that are outdoors, so they glow in the dark after exposure to light in the daytime. Some homes may have an entire wall painted in one color of glow-in-the-dark paint. Either it must have a black light shining on it with the fluorescent paint, or it must receive sunlight for at least four hours a day to light up at night if you use phosphorescent paint. Outdoor projects are perhaps the most common ones that use glow-in-the-dark paint. Your first step is to choose the correct type of glow-in-the-dark paint. You must read the labels to find out what type of material it will work on, such as canvas for paintings, plastic, metal, or glass. First, clean the item that you are painting and let it dry completely. If your project is made of wood, you should lightly sand it before beginning the painting process and sand it again between each coat of primer, paint, and sealer. You will then apply a paint primer to your project so that the paint will adhere better to it. You can use a spray on primer or a brush on primer. Allow your primer to dry completely. Next, apply a coat of your glow in the dark paint. Allow your first coat of paint to dry completely before adding another coat. With all glow-in-the-dark paints, you should ideally use five coats of paint to get a good glowing effect at night. After your last coat of paint is completely dry, put a paint sealer on top of your project to help protect it for many years to come. Your sealant is very important for outdoor projects to keep the paint from rubbing off and to protect it in the outside conditions as well. You will then need to place your project outside in the sunlight for it to charge up and glow when it becomes dark outside. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe.